Hi guys, my name is Jude from EasyTex. In this quick video, I'll be showing you how to fix the problem of unsupported DDR3 memory type on laptops. First, I'm going to demonstrate this problem on this HP ProBook 430G2. So what happens is when I press the power button, a few seconds later, the BIOS gives me this warning for inappropriate memory. It reads, DDR memory type not supported. The system detected that an unsupported DDR3 memory type is installed. Please power off the system and remove the unsupported DDR3 memory to avoid system instability and potential data loss. And then it gives me the option of either powering off the system or hitting the enter button to continue to start up. Now this error is mostly common on newer models of HP EliteBook, ProBook and Dell Notebooks running 4th generation Intel processors. These processors are designed to work with a new type of SODIMM memory called the DDR3 Low Voltage or DDR3L for short. SODIMM is short for Small Outline and Dual Inline Memory Modules which we mostly call RAM or SDRAM. The DDR3L is a dual voltage capable memory which supports operation at both 1.5 volts and 1.35 volts. Unlike the physical difference between the DDR2 and DDR3, the DDR3 and DDR3L look just the same. Same number of pins, same size, hence they are physically compatible. However, the DDR3 is a single voltage capable memory which supports only 1.5 volts operation. Hence, it's not compatible with the systems using 4th generation Intel processors which exclusively support 1.35 voltage operation for memories. So how do you differentiate one from the other since they are both physically the same? Well, the only way is to check the JDEC compliant text on the little stripe of paper normally glued to the back of the memories. So far, I've observed two main conventions that manufacturers use. The first and most obvious one is the PC3 versus PC3L, where PC3 indicates the DDR3 memory and PC3L indicates the DDR3L memory. The second convention is the voltage indication. Some manufacturers would write the operating voltage of the memories on the JDEC compliant text. As you can see on this one, it's written 1.5 volts which implies that it's a DDR3 type of memory. So if you get this error message on your laptop, then chances are your laptop memories have been replaced by incompatible DDR3 and to fix it you need to replace them back with the recommended DDR3L. So is it possible to use a DDR3L on a 4th generation Intel processor? Well. It is possible on some laptops, but is it advisable? Definitely not. As you can see on this one, when I hit the enter button, the laptop would boot up normally. And the reason for this is because both DDR3 and DDR3L have the same clock frequency of 1600 MHz. However, running a DDR3 on a 4th generation Intel processor could lead to system instability which might even prevent the laptop from booting up. And like the notice says, it can also lead to data loss. And if you are combining DDR3 and DDR3L, then chances of instability could even be higher. So in a nutshell, while you can use the DDR3L for both 1.35 and 1.5 volts processors, it is not advisable to use the DDR3 for a 4th generation Intel processor or any 1.35 voltage processor. So here I will replace the DDR3 with a DDR3L. And for those of you who don't know where to find the DDR3L, I would leave an Amazon link in the description section below. And now when I turn on the laptop, this error message won't show up anymore. And that completes the session. Give this video a thumbs up if you found it useful. Share with anyone you think might want to see. If you have any questions or comments, please share in the comment section and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell button for notification on future videos. Thanks for watching and see you again soon.